All right, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome to Until We Die. It is, as far as I can tell, what would happen if you took Metro 2033, crossed it with more alien stuff, and more like base and tower defense, I think. I think that's what this is. It looks really cool. Uh, it's got a bit of a Metal Slug vibe to it, which, like, I'm super big on. I love Metal Slug. I used to play it with my brother when uh, we'd actually share a keyboard together. He would have the D-pad... And I don't know how he would attack, and I would use WASD and, like, spacebar or something like that. It was really awkward. Um, anyway, completely irrelevant, but I'm just looking at this, and I'm like, oh, it's 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 got that Metal Slug look. It's good. Anyway, uh, so this is just the demo. It's not the, not the full game. I don't... I think the full game will be out next month? I'll have to double check. Uh, but it's a little ways out, and it just looked really cool, so I wanted to give it a shot. So... Our scouts confirm the integrity of the ventilation shaft at the Electro Electrozavodoskia station. The decision was taken to gain a foothold in that area and use the shaft to deliver supplies from the surface. Your task is to restore power and supply... Uh, sorry. Restore the power supply to the station and survive for seven days before the arrival of our main forces. Good luck, Commander. Well, this is kind of fun. But yeah, I think we're in Russia. Commander, we're arriving. Will you help out? Help me out? Get some scraps so I can fix the hand car. Okay, so this is me. Summon Maxim. But where's scrap? If I have gun. Okay, scrap is, I guess, over here. Summon? Oh, I see. I have to just tell them to do things. Okay. This already is capturing me. Uh, I'm gonna turn it down by at least one. There's also Twitch integration. I'm gonna leave that for now. I'm gonna turn it down one more time. There we go. That's a bit better. Fix that up. Alright, what else we got? Angar's back on the move. I'll be back tomorrow with reinforcements. First of all, let's start the generator. Alright, works for me. Let's bring this guy over here. Can I? Nope. Because I ha have to wait for them. Generator started. We can equip our camp. Now we need to improve our defenses by building a wall. Okay, loot crates. Loot crates. Nope, can't loot that. It is fine. Order to build. Unfortunately, I think we need more resources to actually be able to build anything, but that's okay. Now, they see this? This is an indie game. <laughs> I'm not even... Uh, I, I guess I should give context. The game I was trying out right before this was utter trash. You know, maybe maybe it was a good game. I I don't know. Maybe it was a fun game. I, I don't know. But it just had all of that kind of like mobile gamey trash stuff that I just wasn't interested in. This feels like a game that like I could sit down and play for a couple hours and say like, yeah, this was worth my time. I'm having a good time with this and I can't wait to play more of it. And this is actually a style I've been looking for in a game for a while-ish. It kind of depends on how this goes, but uh, this kind of reminds me of Kingdom. You can assign people from your squad to walls by sending them to the flag. Engineers and dwellers that were assigned to the walls will repair uh, repair them when needed. Great. Safe behind the wall. Let's make a shovel workshop. A shovel's a soldier's friend. Nope. Uh -uh. Well, we have one at least. But yeah, more control than Kingdom, which is huge. I love... Uh, I love Kingdom. It's a great game. It's a ton of fun. But you don't really do too much. And uh, it felt kind of okay at best. Like, you're just walking around just gathering coins. 
And so the core gameplay loop was really compelling just because it was it was kind of this just chill environment. Um, and this, like, desperate survival. Uh, and you just alternate between the two. And, like, you really had to do a lot to make it work. But I always wanted it to be deeper. For the workshop to start operating, you need to send a worker in there. Diggers are more powerful melee fighters. If you put a digger against a wall, he'll protect it with a shovel. They're excellent at clearing outgrowths. Workshop produces... Uh, the workshop produces tools every day. Okay, so I can turn one of these dudes into a digger. Come on, guys. Let's get to work. Listen to my orders. Explore the surroundings. Build up this place and stay alive. I'm back. I see you could use an extra pair of hands. I, I can help you. I'll get volunteers and scrap if you give me food. Like scrap around here so I can return to the tunnels for the next batch. Okay. So, Agitator. For the next two trips, the merchant brings an additional follower. For each dwelling of the fourth level, one tramp will come to the base. Shelter Network. After lighting the first barrel, one tramp will come to the base. An active barrel increases the population cap by one. The ground ignites around the barrel as uh oh as the day goes by oh those are perks that i can pick up holy shit that's cool yeah this absolutely feels like somebody played kingdom and was like i could make a deeper version of this and voila i didn't realize those are different perks that i could choose between holy shit this is good Okay, let's grab this guy. Okay. Let's see, let Igor do his thing. Oh, I don't actually know what that is. Okay, got anything else I can loot? Not overwhelmingly. What is this that I'm making? I don't know, but I should go deliver... I should go deliver foods to this dude at the very least. Or maybe I did? Maybe I need to pay him a whole ten. Wow, my stamina does not com uh, come back fast. Diggers can clear rubble with shovels. Uh-uh. Okay. Let's just let him go. Uh, let's get the food. There we go. That looks spooky. We're gonna... We're gonna leave that alone for a hot second. The fog is thickening. Let's hide behind the walls. Just wanna grab the last of the mushrooms. Okay, back we go. The walls are weak. Yup. That's something I'd like to work on. For starters, let's give this guy sufficient food. Alright, so he'll come back with more. Okay. Let that guy work on that. I have no idea what that's going to get us. We'll grab another shovel man. Okay, leave Igor there. Even spotted by the left wall. Okay, the hero goes into danger mode for a while. If enemies are near the hero, or... If enemies are near, or the hero is injured. In this mode, you cannot interact with objects and assign people to jobs. Okay. Oh, it only they only attack the left wall at night or tonight. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, the enemies are similar to Kingdom Two. I mean, I'm not gonna fault them too much for it because it's one of those that. 
the environment looks great. The gameplay seems deeper and more interesting. Maybe. At least I have a little bit more control over what's going on. Okay, I doubt we're going to have another wave. Let's grab this guy. Uh, you know what? Let's just take everybody go left. What is this? Nope. Unfortunately, I don't know what these do. But that's fine. Oh. No, that's that's rubble. Let's grab what resources we can. I don't know what that barricade's gonna net us. Or, not barricade, but that rubble is going to net us. Okay, let's let the shovel man do that. Let's take a look at this. Oh, this ti the timer in the top right tells me how long I have before a recruit shows up. Or, I think I get it. They clear this so I can build a wall. Alright. Grab this guy there. Do I want to try and clear this? Here I must be taken in tunnels. No one knows what we'll find here. Okay. There we go. He's skinny and pretty sinewy. He's yours for the taking. Okay, so I've got a. I've got a goon friend. Can we clear this out? I got some science. I'm gonna leave that for the time being. Go the other direction. Okay, F to, or F to reorder your squad. Oh, I see. No scientist. Grab Lev. Grab this guy. I'm pretty sure this guy needs food. I just tell all of them to just raid this. Sadly, no. Yeah, maybe they need better tools. Yeah, we'll see. Send him up, grab what we can. Now the real cool thing would be as if if they actually added multiplayer to this. I would be a very happy camper if they did. One of the things I like so much about Kingdom is that you really could split the load with another person. And it felt really interesting. Okay. Now it doesn't look like I can upgrade this at all. I don't think I'd want another shovel boy. Nope. What is this? Engineers are great support. They can study technologies in the lab, opening up access to station improvements. Engineers left near walls will repair them. Engineers can also build all types of structures and walls in the game. Ah! All right. So let's wait until he's repaired. Oh. Okay. Nope. Ow. That's a problem. Okay, this wall exists, but it's in a bad spot. Boy, my stamina is trash. So I do, I do think I will have to leave my guys near the walls. 
Now, I took damage, or like, I got hit, but it doesn't seem like it really did anything substantive to me. So maybe it's not so bad. Okay. Oh, it takes a while to fix this. For the barracks on my left. Maybe, yeah. It definitely looks like there's there's some kind of something there. That the further I expand out, the more tools and tricks I get. Okay. Looks like this is just another barricade. And that's more dwelling stuff. And then some kind of something. All right, we do have some science. Maybe we, maybe we leave the engineer here. Okay, so he'll work on something new. Grab this guy. Okay, there we go. And then have both of these guys finish this off. It doesn't look like we're getting any more loot. Nope. Oh, that scared me. Yeah, my stamina does not come back fast. Like, at all. Uh, got a volunteer. Okay, and it's gonna be a little bit before I get another one of those. Okay. And then they all go Mushroom Town. I think that's another pile of rubble that we gotta clear. Oh! But if I expand too much, I might not get as many resources. Okay, so I'm gonna put one of these guys here. Have him work on that. That's gonna take a little while. Do you have enough food for another? Well, at least we got some supplies. Oh, right, he brings supplies every day. Yeah, so he straight up is the merchant from... from Kingdom. There you go, send him off. Hey, him. Okay, being spotted by the left wall. Alright. And we hang. Being spotted by the right wall. Oh, boy. Luckily, I do have sh two shovel dudes, so it won't be so bad, but boy howdy, I'm slow. Walls are weak. It's true. But are our, our, our arms spaghetti? If fall destroyed, let's fall back. Oh, gosh. Okay. That's a... That's a legit issue. And when they say our walls are weak, it's no They're not kidding. Our walls are atrociously bad. I mean, luckily, I have a gun instead of a crown, so it's not that bad. And we need engineers to repair them. Unfortunately, I put my one engineer on... Let's see, I, I put my one engineer on, on research. Because I figured we'd need that more. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. At least these enemies are relatively easy to clear. Do we grab that? I don't... I don't necessarily know. I don't, I don't know how we get rid of that, that thing. Okay, diggers gather supplies faster. Let's just ignore this. I don't, I don't know how to deal with it necessarily. I was hoping that the uh, that the tutorial would pick it up or like pick up the details, but alas, no dice. Grab what we can and bail. I'm almost curious if we clear those sections out. Okay. Put those guys there. I'm not going to try building that up yet. Um. <laughs> Grab him. I do have four science. I guess let's have him work on that. Uh, yeah, I should have gone with agitators as a uh, perk. Okay, everybody in on it. And you've got to repair that. Pay him. You are not doing me any good. All right, so I'm just going to leave those guys there. Do we have a wrench yet? Being spotted by the right wall. That's fun. I. <laughs> Well, let's hope my shovel dudes can hold them off. Huh? Oh. Holy shit. I... Oh, God. Okay. The, I... That went bad. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. Seeing as I lost horribly, I'm going to just see what happens when death, death approaches. from this. Okay. Until we die. I'm going to try again. Dave survived. Because... Mm. Stamina does not come back. So diggers can get meat from slugs. Got it. Yeah, the main question was clearing the... Uh, clearing the nests out. Okay, let's skip the tutorial. But yeah, I needed more people. Uh, 
Okay. There you are. Yeah, I was hoping I could remove that nest, but I couldn't figure out how to do it. Okay. Have him fix his business. Okay. Back tomorrow with reinforcements. So he's just he's just gone. Yeah, try a shovel guy. I had shovel guys with me when I I went by it, and it didn't show an interact. My character was like, oh, but that was about it. Unless there was some kind of interaction that I was not doing, which is very possible. wonder if I was somehow still in the tutorial and had like skipped a uh skipped some instructions because I'm not seeing any build build oh no we gotta build the the campfire currently we're just looting everything probably fine for the first night but after the first night it's probably a bad idea Yeah, that's exactly it. Okay. You work that. Hey, losing my people is spooky, too. Okay, generator is started. We can equip our camp. Okay. And you gotta work on that. We get attacked from the left. Unless they destroy our generator, but I have no idea if that's going to be the case. Okay, here we go. Yeah, the problem is we haven't found any barrels. <sighs> Let's go agitator. Okay, let's work that. It should be fine. Let's start, start working on getting the engineers. Okay, extra pair of hands. Okay. Collect that scrap. Let's go back, grab these guys. Because, yeah, I think not having the engineers was a big issue. Okay, pay that guy. Can I upgrade this yet? No. Well, we're already clearing things a fair bit faster. Let's see. I should probably tell one more guy to help this, too. Now that I'm thinking about it. All right. Yeah, the extra manpower is useful. I feel like the barrel could be incredibly strong if I find the barrel. Let's check this. Show resources, reload, ability one, ability two, send unit, call unit, space rush. Okay. Uh 
Okay, I've got... Let's get two shovel dudes. Okay, one of you guys. Yeah, losing my people to this is kind of tough. At least we get an engineer. Okay, let's have him repair that. Oh, I guess it's repaired. Grab what resources we can. I don't think we got any. Oh, we did get we did get one science. Okay, send him off for that. There we go. I'm I'm definitely clearing faster. Grab the food first. Yeah, better to chop them with shovels. How do I how do I chop them with with shovels though? Oh, there we go. So I guess the exclamation marks means chop. Yeah, so if we can clear this, hopefully that means less attack. Okay. Nope. By destroying one growth, others will fall faster, spawn additional eggs. Creatures spawn are spawned from eggs at night. During the final wave, all growths, growths will burst and spawn a large number of mutants. Large individuals can be born from old growths. Well, I mean, that's actually, that's fair. So it sounds like we want to clear as much of this as possible in as short of a period of time to some degree. Oh, it's like a Molotov cocktail ability. Okay. Well, we've got some stuff and we've got some research, which is useful. And yeah, those, those extra volunteers are going to come in incredibly helpful. Yeah, basically, we can boss with, make stuff harder in the interim. Yeah, huh? to some degree. Whoa! <laughs> are they spotted by the left huh? wall? Oh yeah, there they are. Whoop. Okay. Shoot. How's that side doing? Okay, I think we're good. Oh, okay, so it doesn't have to be an engineer. It can be a regular dude. Okay, so let's have them start working on that. We're going to need another barricade here. Let's see, how much science am I sitting on? Have him start sciencing again. Yeah, wall upgrade is severely needed. Yeah, exactly. Unfortunately, getting said wall upgrade, maybe not so easy. Where's my other loose dude? Oh, there he is. Just hanging. Okay. 
Shovel boys go here. Okay, we've got another barricade. And then the gross bits are gone. Yeah, this game needs some time to get everything straight and balance things. Yeah, it, it definitely feels like it's immediately brutal. Now, a couple ways that could offset this. Having substantive meta progression would do the trick. Let's see. I want to get that. Eh, maybe. Yeah, some kind of substantive meta progression would certainly help out. That. Oh, that's a person. Let's wait until we hear. Let's wait until this wall is done. Grab, uh, put these guys on the wall, and then go, go shoot it. Uh, shoot the eggs on the right. We also almost have our science done. Okay, diggers gather supplies, supplies faster. Right, we kind of knew that. Okay, why don't we use the laboratory? Other lack of science? That's why. Whoops. Okay. Oh, burning barrels help our friends recover health. Commander, Commander also catches his breath faster. Useful. So that's what that upgrade's for. Okay, so now I've got three shovel boys. And a science man who I immediately send back to work on more science. Have him work on fixing that. I probably should have left all of them that other that other direction. Oh yeah, it's taking some damage. Oh, that's a that's science right there. All right, day four. Rebuild the wall. It's not too expensive. I still got two guys. Grab grab some food real quick. Oh. Okay. Looking at the game, there are rooms that you unlock by surviving for X number of days. That makes sense. I, it certainly feels good. I think it's mainly just the, the fact that it kind of has no mercy. That's stinking me up a bit. Did I have more? Oh, God damn it! They're probably stuck back there, not actually following me around. I can also recover my health if I wanted to. Let's get rid of this. I don't know how big these maps are.
Hmm. That looks kind of final wave-ish. I could be wrong. Okay. Shoot. You're losing the couple of guys to just stand around here like fools. It is obnoxious. Okay. I... I really... Oh, there they go. Okay, there's one. There's two. Well, at least we can loot things like crazy. The slugs. Yep. Okay. We gotta go back. There we go. Oh, I see. The regular dudes th throw rocks. Okay, we can now build more durable walls. Well, that's a problem. Hey, him. Right wall destroyed. Left wall destroyed. That's this is fun. We desperately need those those better walls. Okay, let's grab everybody. Okay, we have enough science. We just have to get everybody. I think my biggest issue is my sheer lack of sprint speed. Okay, let's get science man going. Get an engineer. Guess I might as well have two of two of those guys work on that. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait. Did that wall spot get destroyed? Yeah, there's supposed to be a wall spot there, but it's it's gone. Yeah, the barrel's helpful for this print issue. True, but it's on the other side. Okay. I'm gonna just leave Boris to it. He'll work on that one. Oh, here it is. Oh, that's why. Okay, let's grab these two. I'm just gonna spend some amount of time hanging. We need to have more durable walls. Yeah, it works like Retropolis and Kingdom. Oh, uh, no, not like Kingdom. Yeah, so I have to have one wall before the next. That is a more durable wall. Start working on that. What are these guys doing? Still going. How much scrap am I sitting on? None. The better walls will go a very long way, though. My big fear is I'm going to get attacked from that other side. But I'm going to get a little bit more scrap. Okay, so it won't be so bad. So let's snag these dudes. We're gonna ignore that wall for the time being. It's it's not worth it. Okay, and that tent raises the pop cap. 
That should give me a fair bit. There's this guy. Makes sense. Grab another shovel. Okay. Shovel re begins. I don't think I can. Let's wait until the wall is done. Actually, gosh, I'm going to leave these guys over by the farthest big wall. I'll handle the right side. These guys should be able to handle the left. Oh, boy. Good luck with that. Yeah, I really needed that campfire. Let's fall back. Holy shit. Well, I did my best. And there goes my generator. Did I at least... I didn't, e I didn't even get to that first one. Oh. For you. There's a dude here now. But yeah, it doesn't look like I can do anything with this. Well, that's fine. I was really hoping I could get the uh, the seven day survival thing. Yeah, how are you supposed to deal with that? I think what you're supposed to do is be much more aggressive at clearing out those nests in those like first couple of days. Uh, potentially even clearing out all the nests on like one side, maybe. Um, I'm not sure. My assumption is this game is not balanced yet. It is not necessarily made to be beaten. It is made to be tried, experienced, and then you lose because they don't have enough content. And so by making the demo hard, it brings back the hardcore audience so they play it more and more and test the game for them. Uh, and then for people like me, it would get halfway and then it's like, all right, that's, you know, that's it. That said... It's kingdom, but deeper, and that's something I've been wanting desperately forever. And so now that I've, I have seen it, it feels really good. It just needs some more time in the oven. Um, let's see. I would say be less aggressive. Didn't the tutorial say the clearing nest makes them harder? No, it it made other nests spawn more eggs to compensate for the lack. Um, but like no matter what, like that was the same numbers that I was dealing with on my first run. Uh, I think. I could be wrong. Kill eggs but not nests. Maybe? Uh, may maybe, yeah. I'd really have to think about it, but the real answer is just like, I, I think we just come back when it hits early access or 1.0 or whatever, and I'm sure it'll be a smoother experience, or at least I hope it will be. Because that's... I don't really feel like I was playing that bad. The main reason why you want to kill those uh, those eggs is because they turn into um, really big enemies for the final wave, and uh, yeah, let's let's just say I don't want to deal with that. That said, I I do not remember this guy here, so maybe it's one of those that every time you lose, this place gets built up a little bit further, and that's just going to be the meta progression, and I just need to lose like one or two more times. I could be potentially up for playing some more, but. <laughs> I feel like it would still be a lot of me trying and then losing, and then maybe finding out it's pointless. So I think I'm just going to wait until it's actually out in some capacity as opposed to just as a demo. Uh, and then we'll come back then and actually have a, lot of time, have, have a lot of fun with it, because this absolutely seems like the kind of game I would love to play. Just not quite yet. Anyway, for those of you on YouTube, if you guys like this video in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like. Helps more than you know. And if you want to see more, hit subscribe. Because, well, we're going to have to wait a little bit before this game comes out. I have so many other games to check out in the meantime. But until then, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.